This baby dragon, if you've never seen one before, is a Mediterranean house gecko. This is a particularly good sized one. I've got him or her inside a mason jar. It can't really climb out of here, but it can climb out of probably anything else that you put it in. They're extraordinary climbers, probably about as good as a tree frog. Very rarely do you get the chance to play with one of these little beautiful guys. Um, they're quite secretive. They mostly come out at night. They're good to have even though they're an invasive species because they eat flies, spiders, gnats, mosquitoes, any kind of bug that's in your house, these guys are going to eat it. And then they're going to leave droppings all over the place for you. So if you've got gecko droppings, you kind of have to say, well, I really don't want that, but I guess I would rather have the gecko droppings than some kind of bug. They also squeak a lot at night. I don't know if they're fighting or mating or both at the same time or God knows what, but uh, they make their presence known. This jar full of sand has a uh, Mediterranean house gecko egg in it that we found in a box of clothes and transported it in here and attached and then we released that little gecko into the house. So now you see the size of the animal and of the egg. It's kind of hard to imagine but they'll actually lay two of these at one time. Cute little egg, cute little lizard. I guess it's not a lizard, it's a gecko. I'm going to link you to a document from the 1930s that talks about these little guys um, saying, have you heard a little gecko because of their tendency to squeak? And I think that the 1930s was probably when the species, somewhere around there was when it was actually introduced to the United States, somewhere around the Gulf Coast, and then it pretty much spread everywhere else in the country. Look at these warts on this beautiful creature. Amazing. They're translucent. They can change color. They go from brown to light pink and yellow. And that's it. They just go and hide somewhere like that and they're gone.